Okay, what's up guys? In this video for the Google Street View profits, profit series, excuse me, we're gonna talk about how to automate your entire business. And this is a really, really important key element because as an entrepreneur, your job is to stack business income streams and remove, and remove yourself from the process. But in order to do that, there's three things you need. You need a process to actually help with that specific customer, right? And you need a team that's going to fulfill on those needs. And number one, of course, I missed the word number one, you need demand, right? So you need to generate demand. And when you're able to do that and you have a process in place and you have a team to fulfill, you have a well-oiled machine that can run without you, okay? That's what an entrepreneur and the CEO does. You automate, right? You build, you automate, you make sure the machine looks good, and then you go to the beach and take a vacation. Now, it's not always that simple, but I'm gonna show you some tools that you can help you get there faster, okay? So, um, let's say you offer three tier offers for Google Street View virtual tours. Maybe it's based on number of photos, say you have five panos, 10 panos, 15 panos, and your middle package tier, or your, or your, third, pa your third tier, has bonuses, like you get a hosted tour in your middle package, or your third tier is you include lead generation or cloud panel live video chat or analytics, etc. cetera. Um, and let's say hypothetically your third tier also helps someone create posts or images for their Google Map listing. So it's like this higher tier package, right? Now, on leadstack.ai, you can create products and sell products with a checkout online 100%, and you can include what's called a one-click upsell. So on the next page, after somebody orders, puts their information in, swipes their card, clicks process. On the next page, you could say, would you like to rush your order? Click here for only $100 more and get moved to the front of the line. So what you've done there with that one click upsell is you have increased the average order value of your customer. You'd be surprised how many folks want their stuff now and want to get moved to the front of the line or they just have a bigger wallet size. They're like, hey, I can go ahead and afford it. I'll say yes to it. Or I'll lock in this or lock in the price or I'll, I'll rush the order, right? Folks do that. And when, when you do that, you have to be able to, to fulfill on the rushed order, of course. But then how do you do that? So on the next page, after someone has said yes or no to their one click upsell, you can offer and show, say, a thank you or even process, you know, to book your time, click here to book the next available slot. And that can be an online embedded calendar built inside the leastact.ai system where you select a time, you select or a date, a time, and you say book, and you can even select whose calendar you wanna pick from. So say you're, you, someone uses you a lot or uses your team a lot and they, and, and they like Bob. They wanna use Bob every time. Well, they can come to your website and click Bob every time and click at you know, three o'clock on Thursday, Bob will come out and they click book and it goes to the next page. Thank you, your, your event has been scheduled, right? So you have this online booking calendar and that calendar can be hooked into Bob's calendar as well, his Gmail calendar, which integrates on leastat.ai. And when this happens, when he books, the customer will get an email that says, we confirm your booking. Um, you can even set up an automation where they get a text message that says, we've got your order and we have your, your booking is confirmed. We'll let you know if there's any problems. Now, because this whole system's online, you can add what's called that specific person to a stage in your what's called an opportunities pipeline. Opportunities pipeline is just stages of the customer's journey, right? You can track new customers, say big customers on the opportunities pipeline. Make sure you follow up with them and don't forget about them or lose track. And you can have current customers that we're just trying to fulfill on in, an, in, in, in a different pipeline. In that pipeline, if someone has paid and they've booked a time, they're probably gonna be waiting on fulfillment, like waiting on photos, right? And so the back end now, when that person shoots the photos on location, they can email them to your admin or just drop them in a Dropbox, Google Drive, et cetera, get the photos to your admin. Your admin can then move that person to the next stage in the pipeline, which could be photo editing, right? So photo editing, you could outsource overseas because it's a digital product. So you can outsource editing, editing comes back in 24 hours. Your admin can assemble the tours, publish them to, the, to their Google My, My Business page, and then, um, of course, two, 24 to 48 hours later, when it's published and live, that admin can inform the customer, customer, congratulations, your, your free, free tour is, is published. To see the link, click here. They just go to, their web, go to their listing, pull the link, and send over to the customer so they can look at it and review it, okay? Of course, the customer at this point can say, thank you, excited to see it, et cetera. And what you can do is ask for a review or referral at this point. So your admin can have those pipeline stages in place. Have we asked for a review? Have we asked for a referral, right? So those things are in place and of course, 
when you ask for a review, you can send over your review link, or you can even send over a, a couple of different three or four or five stars options. And if they don't pick five, you don't send them over to the review link. You say, hey, how can we make it better next time, right? Simple stuff. So that's called re reputation management. So you wanna manage your reputation online and you wanna ask for referrals as well too. So that's the fulfillment side of the fulfillment process. What do you need? You need a person who can take photos and you need an admin who can take care of you. An admin can be someone in the Philippines or Vietnam or, or India that you trust and like that can help run your business digitally. All the digital backend, the paperwork, they can run that, right? Cloud Piano has 24 hour coverage. We have some great admins that help us and our team is overseas, right? So that's the admin, right? Very, very important. And of course, fulfillment, someone who can go take the photos in the right format and settings you like so that you can edit and post process them. So if it's a Ricoh Data Z1, they want to send they want to send over a HDR DNG file or raw file that that is uh, from dual pitch plugin. Well, if you tell that instructions and, and they know how to do it, cool, the editor can take that file, make it look beautiful and send it back to your admin. The admin can assemble, the admin can send it over, right? So this is a little machine of fulfillment, right? So when you have the process, you're using Least Deck AI to take your order processes and to keep everything organized. And you also have your admin or you also have sales, right? So you, so you have, your, you have your, your process, photography services on location, and you have your fulfillment of, of sending that stuff over to a customer, making sure you're getting paid, sending out invoices if needed, getting signatures if needed, sending receipts if needed, right? That process, those SOPs are in place because you help build those, right? The next thing you need to help fulfill on or help, help have systematized is sales. So how do you systematize, systematize sales? Well, fortunately, in the latest stack the AI tool, you have a lot of tools at your disposal. You can make websites, you can make funnels, you can make lead capture forms, you can use the chat bot and go back and forth with the customer that captures information. You can capture their name, email, and phone number on the chat bot and start texting them directly from the mobile app. Very, very powerful. So you can you can basically have your whole systematized sales process on the front end run inbound, run by your admin. So if you have good Google ads, if you have good ads that work and convert based on intent based advertising, you have your system that fulfills and captures those leads and your admin runs it, or it's just, they click here to order now and book now. It's all 100% online using leadstack.ai, really powerful. If you have a photographer who can go shoot it and their calendar is attached to that account in Leadstack, what you have now is a system you can take your hands off. So if you target the right keywords and you know how to do phrase match targeting right and you do a good job with ads and you, and you manage your budget and time and location constraints well, then you can send people to your booking system. It fulfills, takes care of itself, everyone's in communication and expectations are automatically laid out because it's all automated with how it fulfills, how they get notifications of payment received, make sure you book here, you know, booking received, make sure you give us, you know, 24 hours or 48 hours, et cetera. The admin can keep track of every single order and then you can make sure you pay your people and pay them well. You're gonna have a good little system. Remember, as the, as the entrepreneur, you keep what's left over. You keep, you get paid last. Okay, it's really, really important. If you may think, well, Zach, I don't wanna get paid last, I get paid first. Well, if you pay your team well, and you pay your fulfillment sub subcontractors well, and those are smooth operations, what you get in exchange is time. You get freedom. You get to do whatever you want with, with that time. So when I've done this before in the past where I created a very high time value business and I decided, hey, I wanna go bigger. Let's go build a software out. So that's why we have Cloud Pando and this, have this whole community of 60,000 users and 200,000 projects on the platform and it's this whole thing. You know, So I love building business, so that's why I'm building Cloud Pando. But you don't have to do that. When you, you, when you sell a local service like Google Street View, you can create time freedom for yourself. You just have to know how to build the system. So when you use, use leadstack.ai and using Cloud Piano, that's all you need to pull all the right levers and really create a business that also gives you freedom, which is a big deal. Hope this, hope this is helpful. Hope this is the right mindset you're thinking about. You need to get paid last. You keep what's left over. You know, you manage your, your advertising budget, you manage your people budget, and, you, and then you work on keeping the, keeping all the things smooth, baby. Keeping the lights on, keeping the money flowing. And then of course, you'd be surprised. One day you'll wake up and go, holy cow, I got this whole machine we've built. Well, how'd that happen? Right, so in summary, you need three things. You need demand, you need systems, like leadstack.ai, and you need people, okay, good people. Those three things, you can create freedom. I'll talk to you soon. Hope this video was helpful.